and Cortex left us, so we're by ourselves now. Again. Just Crash and the Tiki Mask. And our first problem is the big wall of nitro crates. So you gotta hit the top. Uh, and uh, yeah, you have to do that carefully. And they reset you by Cortex, but then you gotta watch that little clip again. So you have to time your spin jump, and you're supposed to time your spin jump over here. You have to activate this nitro crate, which I didn't see. I <laughs> try to hit the top one, that's, that's funny. Yeah, so this this is where it gets a little tricky because most of this level is dark. Yeah, I'm not going for that um, one. Uh, one of I'm not confident, <laughs> so I'm not going for that one. Wow. I um I didn't that's crazy. <laughs> yeah, I'm not trying that again. Uh, so as you can see I'm not a good crash player. <laughs> This game is really fun though. And I'm sure the other crash games are fun too. Well the three before this. I don't know anything about the games after this. Yeah, I should have watched where I landed last time. I just fell right into that. And we're back we're out of the cave. And this is a boss fight, I think. Ooh, that feels good. I was bursting in there. How are you fools? Before the awesome might of the evil twins. Aren't you too adorable? Let me see. I might have some chalky treats here for you. Chalky treats? Ooh, ooh. We've some good news and some bad. The bad news? We're going to destroy your precious islands. The good. You won't be around to see it. How tiresome. Oh, you wanna play mind games? Okay, tough guy. <laughs> Let's play mind games. This is the part where you run away screaming. <laughs> Go on, run, catch you later, Brainiac. Um, all right, though. Uh, the boss fight is not right now. Then I thought it was now because it involved those aliens. Sorry. Um, both of those aliens were voiced by Quentin Flynn. Um, he voiced a lot of characters like Axel from Kingdom Hearts, and he was Johnny in the '90s uh, Fantastic Four cartoon. Um, the second season, because that show had two seasons, and one season was with, um, was different than the second season. It was the same show, though, but I don't know, it was confusing. But whatever. Uh, Human Torch Johnny. I forgot to say that. Cause I don't really call him the Human Torch by accident. I call him I call him Johnny. <laughs> oh, does anyone call him Human Torch? Like anyway, we have to go find Cortex because he has no brain. And I don't know why I felt 
into that hole. That was a stupid death. I have a lot of stupid deaths in this game. So this one is really... Uh, well, I thought I was going to blow up. Damn it. Yeah, more stupid deaths. <laughs> yeah, so when you play in this game, you gotta take your time. Or plan ahead. Or just don't rush, because if you rush, you're gonna die. I have been, I have been watching the the gameplay of the Insane Trilogy that just came out. I saw the whole playthrough of one. They really did good with that, um... What do you call it? HD remaster? To help me crash. You heard them. They want to destroy our island home, humiliate and enslave you, and steal my brain. How I envy the simple life of the tribe's folk. <laughs> Living in harmony with Mother Nature, the noble boar, the humble bumblebee. <laughs> <laughs> so, this was another level in the demo. I think this was the last level in that demo. And everything's attacking Cortex, and you have to activate these stints so he doesn't die. Not the bees. Not the beast. And now the <laughs> this part of the um, game is pretty funny. Ah, oh. damn it. That was so close. I thought I hit it the second time. Didn't make that mistake again. I think a bear, um, yeah, a bear comes out after this. That's when it gets crazier. That was close. Yeah, I only get gems if they're in my way. And here's the bear. He doesn't even know a bear is chasing him. <laughs> but I don't know if the bear bites down on the hive. The bees, is gonna, the bees are going to sting him. So... I, I don't know. And that's... That was it. And this is it for this episode. See you next time.